are you looking at her? What? Do you like her? <gasps> Tell me! What do you keep looking at her? Let go of her, Monica! I don't know what you're talking about. You're so cynic. I'm seeing you how you devour her with your eyes. Please, I was just looking at her cross. I don't understand your jealousy. You know what? I don't have time for this. I'll go to my study. Do what you want. You know what? If you want, you can also take her with you so she can accompany you. Monique, stop! Excuse her, just one minute. Excuse my fiance. So toxic. See all the mess you caused? And also, who do you think you are to be wearing shoes? Are you the queen of the place? You are nothing but a simple sir. <gasps> no, no, please. It's a familiar antique. And also look at you. You look like a nobody. No, please. Let go of me. Give me my necklace. Please. Let go of her. Leave her alone. I'm sick of your nonsense jealousy. What? No, love. What are you doing? It's my engagement ring. I'm not going to marry a woman that doesn't trust me. Please, Monica, go to therapy for your own good. Oh, yeah. Well, then, let's see who goes with you to that dinner tonight. Monica! Here. I can tell it's valuable. My grandpa gave it to me a long time ago. Hey, I barely know you. Tell me about yourself. The truth, there's not much to tell. Just, I'm a simple servant. You are so much more than that, I can tell. I want to ask you for an apology for what Monica did. No one has the right to treat you like that. Now I don't know what I'm going to do with the dinner. I can't show up with anyone. <sighs> do you want to go with me? Me? Yes. But, but, if your fiancé finds out, she could fire me. <sighs> and besides, I don't have time, nor a cute dress or those things. <laughs> don't worry about that. I'll take care of everything. I'll make sure you're the most beautiful woman. All right, sir. Call me Gustavo. It sounds better. <laughs> Let's go. Come with me. <laughs> Ready? Shall we go? You look amazing. Let's go. <laughs> hey. I really loved your company today. The truth is I had a really good time too. And I want to thank you that you introduced me as a friend and not as a servant. <sighs> I told you to call me Gustavo. I did it because you're a great woman. Jasoni, remember that the value you keep to yourself is the value everyone else is giving you. You're right. Um, I don't know why Monica and you are still together. You are very different to each other. I know. Many times love makes you blind and doesn't let you see the right one. Don't you think? Yes. And more when we ourselves are the blind. Just honey. You are so pretty. I don't know why I took so much to realize that. Hush, have you seen Joswani? Um, yes sir. Uh, she's kinda sick. She doesn't feel good. What? 
She didn't tell me anything. Well, is that that was yesterday? She said it was because she was forced to go to a meeting. Mm, by the way, she's so angry. Okay, thanks. Uh, I'm sorry. Sizing that we're talking about Joswani, I would like to know if there's a problem in which she and I maintain our relationship. Uh, we both know how to separate her job. Uh, how come? You two are Yeah, yeah, yes. It's been a year now. We've always been very discreet, but I think it's time to talk with the truth. The, the Later we continue with that, don't worry. Monica? The plan just came up as we expected. Mr. Gustavo already knows the truth. Gustavo! Oh, my love. It's good to be back. I'm happy too, my love. Joswani, I need you to have the dinner ready. Today, my family is coming over because we are announcing our wedding date. And for that, I want something spectacular. Because today will be one of the greatest days of our lives. But come on, move it! Start! Our best day is waiting. Hurry up, sir, Ben! We don't have your time, mate. <sighs> Gustavo! you call him? Now that I'm back, I want you to remember which is your place here. You are, and always will be, just a simple maid. Yes, ma'am. Joswani, I need you to have the cups ready for the toast. Please. Yes, sir. And quickly. Do you have a problem with that? No. I don't have any problem with you or your fiancé. And I want to let you know that today is my last day here. How? What do you mean? I'm no longer going to work here. I understand that it's better for me to go. I like that. I won't get in the way of your marriage. So do you plan to leave Hosh? My love! Your new suit is here already. Thank you, love. Well, let's go so you can try it on. <laughs> Where are the cops? <laughs> well, family... I would like to toast because in one month... I'll get married to this beautiful woman. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Have a nice ride back, family. Thanks for coming. What are you doing with that luggage? I'm leaving. I want you to have a happy marriage. And that only will be if I'm not here around. Are you sure it's just for that? Or because you don't want problems with your boyfriend? What are you talking about? I, I told you that I don't have time for those things. Please. Hosh already told me everything. <sighs> he dared to ask me for permission to be with you at my house. But if I barely know him, I've never had a relationship with anyone for my work. I don't understand. What? He told me you had a year now. No, that's a lie. But you know what? Instead of being worried about me, get worried for your wife, for your future wife. And I would have liked to. I would have liked to know that you two were going to come back. And do you know what I would like? To be with you, Joswani. You're a very different woman who makes me feel free. Joswani, 
I thought you were with Hosh. But that miserable will hear me. <laughs> your siblings. It's not what you think. He forced me and tried to kiss me. Uh, that's not true. Uh, she has been threatening me to fire me if I don't do what she wants. Now I get why all those annoying stupid jealous to me. A thief believes that everybody's like him. And you deceitful. That explains why you were pretending to have a relationship with Joswani. That's not true. Let me explain you. Explain what? Get the hell out of my house. Sir, I'm so sorry. You don't have to, Josuani. And don't call me sir. I'm Gustavo. Josuani, I don't want you to leave the house. Sir, I already packed my stuff. And besides, I already get someone to replace me. No, you're not getting it. I don't want you as my mate. I would love you to be something else. Me, I'm just a simple servant. No, Joswani. I looked for you for a long time. And now that I found you, I don't want to lose you. I know that I'm going fast, but for a lot, there are no impossibles. There are no times. I want to be with you. After that dinner, I could really know the real man my boss was. And I loved it so much. The differences of social classes will always become a problem. And much more when we take them seriously. The important thing is the heart of that person. Since that is when he'll show us what true love 